This is a normal brain, and here one eaten away by Alzheimer's disease. For decades, scientists have tried to find a cure. Today, there are reports that researchers have made an important step forward. Some even described it as historic. For the first time, scientists have stopped brain degeneration in mice by giving them a drug that blocks one of the signals thought to start the process off. If it stops brain degeneration in its tracks, it will halt disease in people who've already got it. And if we de if we can detect um, early disease, then it could prevent a lot of degeneration. So, this the, the hope for something like this is that we are able to arrest the process of cell death, of brain cell death, and that's what's so exciting. Hundreds of thousands of people in Britain suffer from Alzheimer's and other degenerative brain disorders, such as Parkinson's and Huntington's disease. So what could this development mean for them? The human brain is far more complex than those of mice, and the drug used on the mice has unacceptable side effects, so scientists will need to find a similar one that works the same way. Any treatment for Alzheimer's and any other brain diseases would therefore be at least 10 years away. We must be quite cautious because this is really early stage research and we need to do uh, a whole lot more research to really understand what this means, but to turn it into a potential new drug, testing clinical trials to see if it is a safe and effective treatment for people with the condition. Some scientists, though, have described the development as a turning point, which will provide researchers with an important new lead in their search for a cure for Alzheimer's and other debilitating brain diseases. Palad Ghosh. BBC News.